Hey guys, Guy Christian 9 here again with the third course of level 1, Castle Hyrule. And look, the owl's back. How do I know it's an owl? Because it chirps like a duck. Alright, so, uh, someone's leeching power, blah. Rescue the maidens, keep your wits about you. And remember to eat bacon. Alright, so, this is Hyrule Castle. Of course, not exactly Hyrule Castle yet. This is Hyrule Castle. And that guy just threw a bomb at me. What a jerk. I'll remember this. Anyways, uh, use these bombs to actually burn these fields. And you'll get quite a few force gems. And by the way, there are quite a few force gems in this course too, so nothing like what will happen in the Cave of No Return. Alright, so the left path, uh, I'm trying to go down the hole. Uh, the left half, uh, the right path has nothing, the left half has the hole you want. Up there is a few bases with some hearts if you got damaged too much. Let's go up this, and look, another 20, yay! The swords are gaining power! Alright, to solve this, uh, throw one of your links across and then switch that link to get on the other switch. And there's only two switches. I was an idiot there. Summoned all the guys there, so that made things easier. So, uh, now we're up there, there's another chest, and more gems. Yay, I'm feeling brave. And, hello, remember me? Ha ha! Revenge is a bitch! And hit the switch and you get to go in. And look, a force fairy! Yay! Now I got eight. So now if I die, I have eight more lives. I'm, I should get into the pruning business, because Link is a pretty good pruner, I must say. Alright, so here's the mini-boss event, uh, the chief soldier from, uh, the first course. Uh, it's a good idea to get rid of all of his soldier friends first, since there is quite a few of them. And you can see a few fortunes fell down from the, uh, sky because I killed so many in quick succession. But, uh, this guy basically works the same way that it did in the first course, so nothing new here. So I'll take the time to issue a shout out. And this one's gonna be to someone that um, I recently found out on and is pretty cool. Mr. Dower Power. All one word. Uh, as I get this chest, I'll tell you about him. Um, he's got quite a few videos up already. Like, he's done a few Let's Play projects, but he doesn't have too many subscribers. And it's a shame, though, because, like, I watched a few of his videos. He's done um, uh, Ocarina of Time. He's doing um, Turtles in Time. And if you're wondering why I skipped that switch on the left, it just summons guards, so don't bother. But uh, yeah, I watched a few of Dower Power's videos, and um, I've met him a few times on the chat room uh, that SM41 has. And he's a really nice guy, and he's a pretty good commentator too, and his videos are pretty good. You should go check them out. Alright, so uh, getting back to the game now, uh, we're on Hyrule Castle proper now. Uh, take the left path first. Obviously, there's a block out of the way, so um, go inside. Now you hear you get either the bow or the fire rod, but uh, get the bow. You're gonna need the bow. Um, get a blue bracelet again. So a blue, a blue bracelet in every course now, which is pretty awesome. Uh, don't uh, hit those switches yet. First, go back out and get those four gems, then go on the switch. And uh, 150 will summon at the bottom. So yeah, this is just for the sake of time. Alright, so, um, Hyrule Castle, in opposition to, um, Cave of No Return, this is actually a pretty long course. In fact, th um, this video goes up to 10 minutes, uh, the, the second part will go up to about 9 or so. But yeah, I was worried that this, uh, course would take 3 videos, but luckily I was able to get it done in time. So the right path, make sure you go down the lower, um, door, uh, area first. Push the block and you get a f 100. But uh, this course, since it's so long, there is plenty of opportunities to get force gems, and I'll have quite a few at the very end. And you see, there's a key, so we gotta go hunting for a key. And since the left path only had force gems and a bow, um, we gotta go to the right path now. All right, so here another unassuming area. Um, basically, this is when you need the bow. In here, you see that there is um, a gap that you cannot cross, but. If you shoot a bow through the uh, door, you'll hit that switch and you'll be able to continue. Now go down here. And, oh look, 20. Oh look, 100. 
Wee. Yeah, whatever. So, bombs. Bomb flowers, I guess. This is how you continue. Obviously, there's a crack in the wall, so we must blow it up and set fire to the nearby garden. Link is so responsible, huh? I mean, they're like, thank you, Link, for saving our land. And he leaves half of it in ruin. Alright, so... Oh, look! There's the key! Alright! Oh. Well, um... I actually did a, a recording prior to this, and, like, that first cannon, I, I just failed it up. It took me, like, four times to get through the damn thing. I just kept missing. Like, I would go under it, I would go over it. It, it sucked. Alright, so we got the key. Uh, there's a keys, but no challenge at all. Now, this next part is a bitch. Alright, so first you got these uh, uh, sword soldiers here. And so I go to cross formation because I can. And I thought that guy was dead. Now, here's one of the more annoying parts. The ball and chain knight. Uh, basically, all you do is you have to duck uh, through his... Uh, ball and chain and swipe it. And you, I think it's uh, four times you hit him? Yeah, I got cream there. Oh, five, six, about six strikes. After you kill him, it's a trap! Ah, oh, God, look at all those knights. Holy crap. It's like I will send its entire army at me. Look at that, 12, 13 characters killed at once, and whoa, what the hell happened there? Wow, that was a slaughter. Look at that, 18 enemies killed without damage, that is amazing. And you get a bunch of portions as a reward, and understandably, the sword powers up. Yay, so, uh, don't have to do any time travel this course. And we're still pretty much halfway through. So, uh, as you can see, the way forward is barred because of a magical barrier. And here's Shadow Link, but don't go directly across. Go around the corner. You'll see why eventually. But put Red Link back where Shadow Link was, and then lure him back. And down goes he. <laughs> 19 kills. I am good at this. Alright, so to get this, uh, go into cross formation and um, swipe. And that's why. Because uh, that path that Shadow Link was uh, mysteriously guarding was a uh, pitfall. Alright, so uh, before you go into this room, uh, break these pots and push this um, Armo statue onto the switch. And you can see it reveals a glass panel. And it allows you to see, otherwise this room would be very, very dark. And you don't want that. Alright, so uh, do not press the um, noticeable switch because it summons three regular soldiers. And you can see, I've killed so many people without damage that I'm just getting so many gems now. Alright, so underneath the right gem is a switch and, whoa, what the hell is that thing? It looks like something that Shadow Mario made. Ah, I should stop bashing with the guy. He's a pretty nice guy. Or not. Alright, so he... This person got split in two, and... I don't know how that works. And, uh... We gotta make this thing whole. Well, I'm sorry, but we gotta... You know, free the maidens and all that. I mean, Vadi is out destroying the world and all that. Well, whatever. Since the way is uh, barred, I guess I'll have to help you out. And blah. Why does Link have to be such a good Samaritan? Why can't he just put a sword through everything? Alright, so, um, an annoying Shadow Link with a, a power hammer or whatever it's called. It can make things difficult if you're trying to kill those guards. Alright, this is the first, uh, wide switch. And that unlocks that. Now, I'm getting towards the end of the video here, so, um, I guess I'll have to wrap it up soon. Uh, blade traps, uh, get bombs here. You're gonna need it. Because, as you see, there's a cracked thing. And so, I'll end it here. This is Guy Kush 9. Now I have bombs. Without more shoes, too. And in the next video, we'll find out what's in the other side of this hole. So, see you later, guys.